Hello my YouTube people and welcome back to Mine and Cat's channel. This is Ken checking in here. I'm, I'm gonna go over here because I don't want to bend down. I'm gonna be taking you guys through a Monday vlog. It is currently Monday. I'm training lower body. Kat's gonna come with me to the gym. She's gonna be training full body, but I don't think we're gonna film her, but... You guys know we love a good old Monday. It's just a fresh start to the week. You guys had an off week last week. Maybe you weren't on track. You didn't get everything done that you needed to get done. It's okay, girl. It's a new week. We start now. We start today. But I'm excited for the day. You guys are going to see what we're up to. I ate my breakfast, drank my decaf coffee. I'm going to go ahead and take my pre-workout in just a minute. And we're going to hop right on into this vid. Let's freaking go. And one more thing, you guys. Our Feed Your Soul merch is restocking this Thursday, April 15th. I mean, we show the I mean, you guys, this is like one of our favorite items that we have released and she's coming back for y'all. She's coming back. It's like an, uh, I guess like not like an acidy wash, but it's kind of like a distressed um, teal. And then this is a light pink puffed writing. It's so, this is cute. Ah, it's so cute. Have it cropped. Feed your soul tea with the cute little logo on the back. I love this the most. She's us. freaking cute. It's cream. It's beautiful. This Thursday at 11 a.m. Already started cropping this, but I'm like, I might as well show them. I put it on and for this, I'm just tucking it into my sports bra so it doesn't need to be like a perfect like length crop. But usually when we crop our stuff, you guys, we try and wash it beforehand just because like when you crop it, it's gonna shrink in the dryer and it comes up even higher. But these are already pre-washed, so if you want to crop it, like, when you get it, you can just go ahead and do so, and it won't shrink in the wash. But I'm just going to show you guys how I do this. I literally just lay it flat. I feel like this is literally just common sense, but I just lay it flat and just try my best to cut a straight line. I mean, I feel it's pretty self-explanatory. When I have it on, I'll grab it, say, like, right here, like, where I want it cropped, and I'll just snip a little line, and then I'll fold it in half like this, and then snip a line here and then like so and then snip a line in the middle that way when i'm cutting it i kind of know where the ends should meet therefore it's as straight as possible this is her like i said i'm not wearing this fully cropped i'm just gonna tuck it in today Ugh. my pet peeve is when my eyebrows are like not like when my eyebrows come down like this, I always have to do this because it just bugs me. Okay, so it's like a little bit longer right now. And then I'm just gonna tuck it in. But you don't wanna crop this too short because I still want that like that looser look. And if it's too short, it's gonna be like, you're gonna have to tuck it in too much. Yeah. Are you kidding? So cute. Here we go, baby. Kat is currently getting ready for the gym, and then whoever gets ready first usually just gets our pre-workout together, and that's usually Kat. Kat usually gets ready before me, so I'm taking over today. Uh, she'll appreciate that, but I'm just gonna do two scoops of high volume per use. Two scoops here, two scoops here, and then one scoop of true creatine. These are both from Pea Science, and then you guys know that we will sip on our prolific on the way to the gym. That's kind of why I had a decaf earlier, because I know it was going to be training like pretty soon after my breakfast and I don't want to have that much caffeine so I chose a decaf that way I can sip on my pre. I'm gonna wait for Kat to take this and we're gonna get hyped and get ready. Honestly Kat and I already took our pre-workout. She's right over here but I'm getting ready. I'm actually got a little bit hungry. Surprise surprise so I'm just eating a little snack. I took most long. random like a little rye cracker with turkey and then sugar-free ketchup. It sounds gross. Have you showed them the yogurt yet that we're obsessed with? You'll have to show them. No, I don't want to show them because then it's gonna, either we're not gonna be able to get it in stores. <laughs> Is that selfish? I'm training full body. I'm doing, I'm doing heavier squats, deadlifts, and then I'm actually supposed to do bench press today, but Ken and I, okay, so I like kind of tweaked my chest probably like two and a half weeks ago. So I've been taking it easy and just like not doing anything that stretches. I'm like, I'm able to do overhead press or like side raise, front raises, just nothing that like stretches my chest backwards like this motion, but it's feeling really good now. So I'll probably like reintroduce benching movements at the end of this week. But Ken has also been dealing with the, the same, same exact, exact thing, thing except and mine's Mine was more so stemming from like my bicep and my elbow and then it was kind of leading into my <laughs> leading 
into my chest. But I also took a week off of chest pressing. I was overhead pressing and that felt fine, but it's doing so much better. But yeah, it's overall just, I'm feeling a lot better, which I'm super happy about. Yeah. It's just weird because it's like we're twins. We kind of have like the same injury going on right now, but we are on the same routine and we haven't been training together like really at all. Uh -huh. So it's just total coincidence. But this has happened before. Like years ago, we like kind of both bugged our traps, but... I don't know. It's just a weird little coincidence. Mm -hmm. Okay. We're gonna go nice. get it. Okay, we just pulled up to 20, just pulled up. We just, <laughs> <laughs> we, we went to 24 hour, which is like our main home gym. And then we're like, mm, we need to go somewhere more hyped. I'm just like down to like freaking train hard as hell right now. And you guys there's know it's like, Monday, it's like, leg day. I'm just, I need something intense. There's different, in this. there's different gyms for like different vibes. I totally. Like. Well, we're lucky that like our gyms are open and we do have the options to like go to different ones, but. <laughs> I'm about to have this session. <laughs> Let's freaking go. Okay, I'm doing three sets of 10 at 195. <laughs> You're set. <laughs>
just got back from training. I had a pretty damn good session. Cat? Me too, I'm dead. Me too, we're dead. We're really hungry. Cat's making ground beef tacos with some veggies and then I'm just gonna have these thin bagels that I get from Mother's Market. I'll show you guys in a second with some chicken, possibly a side of veggies, maybe just some greens, but and let's then chef it probably up. probably some oatmeal. And probably some oatmeal <laughs> with some cashew or peanut butter. Okay, I cooked this. I think yesterday, so I don't have any plastic bags. Here's my chicken. And then these are the bagels that I use. I get these from a local market. Honestly, my calories aren't extremely high right now. Pat's eating a good amount more than I am. Lower calorie stuff in the meantime is perfect for me because I just, I need more volume. For two of these bagels is 37 carbs, four grams of protein, and six fat and I'm probably gonna have like five ounces of chicken that'll hold me over and then your girl's got to go do some cardio surprise surprise we are going to weigh This is the struggle of having <laughs> one scale. Why don't we have more than one? Because <laughs> we brought it to Keeley's. I don't have any mustard, so I'm just putting some salsa on this. I know this is just so freaking random. I'm just working what I have in the fridge. For some extra flavor. Yeah, give me some sauce. You guys, I'm so hungry. And then of course, everything but the bagel. All right, all right. Yo, look how good cat's food looks. I'm gonna put some fahe yogurt Are you on. freaking kidding me? Wait, 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 give him a dollop. This is the yogurt we were talking about earlier. It's amazing. The consistency is really good. It's like very thick. We're used to a more watery kind of consistency, especially being we use like plant-based yogurts most of the time, but this hasn't been upsetting our stomachs or really aggravating our skin. So we've been uh, sticking that's with debatable. This guy. It might be aggravating our skin, but it also might be like PMS and alcoholic alcohol beverages and <laughs> not using <dairy>. creology and <laughs> a few other things. There's some other factors in there too. Exactly. Here's my little Sammy's. I said earlier that I don't have as much food to work with as Kat does. I'm eating lower calorie than she is. I decided to go into a pretty, I guess you can say aggressive calorie deficit for me. And then I also increased my calories just because I wanna get cut real quick and then we're gonna reverse diet, go through that process, which is the breast process. And I'm so excited for that. But yeah, girl's hungry, so here we are. Mm -mm. I haven't had the peppers on this before. These are actually really, really good. I got these at Trader Joe's. And regarding our leg day, or my leg day, and then Kat's full body day, we did not film every single exercise that we did, but we will be posting my entire leg day on our Instagram, which is kk underscore fit underscore. We also post so many meal ideas, workouts, and if you guys want to follow along with like our day-to-day -day life, that's kind of where we post the most. But I'm just getting ready to go do some cardio. I'm gonna be doing 30 minutes total, either like 10 minutes on the stairs and then I will incline walk for the remaining 20 or I might just incline walk for 30 minutes total. We'll see, we'll see, we'll see, we'll see. Here we are, this is literally my favorite jacket to do cardio in, just an oversized windbreaker. I don't think this one's in stock anymore. This is obviously from Gymshark. Then I'm wearing the Paws joggers. These are just comfy and lightweight and super stretchy. I think these are a size extra small. I think this is a size men's small or medium. A little bralette and then this Nike Akron's. These are just super light, airy and breathable and pretty comfy. We're here, I chugged my water and we're ready to go. cardio session was pretty dang easy like I could have easily kept going that's one thing I like doing cardio 
after my training. If I train, come home, eat, and then go do cardio, I feel like I still have like a good amount of energy. Therefore, like my cardio session isn't so much of a drag, and that's how it was today, thankfully. But we're about to go home, clean up, shower. Oh, hi puppies. <laughs> hi babies. And then Kat and I actually have an appointment at 5.30, so we will be doing that. I don't think I'm gonna eat again. I'm not very hungry, but I think I'm gonna have a green juice just because my post-workout, I didn't have any veggies at all, and I said I was gonna have one, so we're sticking to it. Gotta get those micros in. It is the next day. I went ahead and got some groceries this morning, which I'm gonna show you guys in a second. I just got some necessities that I needed. I didn't really grab that much, but I do wanna show you guys some exciting things right now. So, you guys, Gymshark is coming out with new camo, camo shorts. I remember Kat and I cut a pair of camo leggings like a year and a half ago, and we're like, yo, like this needs to be an actual thing. These fire just so fire they have the little scrunch on the side they're coming out with a few new colorways this super pretty red color like a black and gray combination and then this green is just i feel like everybody looks so good in green this color is lighter than the previous green this is like the older camo green i just wanted to do a little comparison here you can clearly see this is a lot darker i love both of these you guys the camo is our absolute favorite Anything like Adapt, the Adapt Seamless, the Adapt Camo, you just really can't go wrong. They have this scrunch butt here, so you just pull it up your crack a little bit and it just makes the booty look so juicy. They have the scrunch here on the front. And then I do like that they actually have both sports bra options. They'll have them available. The release date on this stuff is to be announced, but I'll let you guys know as soon as I know. But as you can see, this one is like a crisscross on the front and then it has a good amount of back detailing. Like I would prefer this one just because, I don't know, like I don't like the, fr I don't love the look on this on me. Although I like, I see Whitney in this and I'm like, girl, like you look so far. Like, I don't know. I just, I prefer these ones over these ones. The back on this has the scrunch here. Both of these are pretty dang supportive. So if you do have a bigger bust, those are like a good option for you. I currently, I'm wearing a size small and everything, but I know Catherine likes to wear a size extra small. But if you guys aren't super familiar with Gymshark and you want to try a pair of staple leggings or you just want to try them out or you're looking for something new to spice up your workout outfits, then I would highly recommend the Adapt Camo or the Adapt Ombre Seamless is so fire, like so fire. The Adapt Ombre Seamless is like slight compression and just like it has like a nice double whipped waistband. It makes you just look so freaking good. Let the butt crack a little bit to make the booty look real nice. I do love that the camo print does hide a good amount. Like if you have like cellulite that you don't want showing, if you have like lines or like a little bit of extra jiggle on your lower body that I would highly recommend the camo just because it has that print so it kind of like it covers that up like you really can't see anything and the material on these you guys is just like it's like a thicker but like stretchy material and I don't know like you know how there's some leggings that like make your legs look good you know what I'm talking about like some leggings you warm to the gym and you're like are you freaking kidding me like no like just not a vibe these like do something for that lower body if you know what I'm saying. The release date I said is to be announced, but of course we'll let you guys know as soon as I know. And then they also have this like super pretty light pink color, whereas the camo print on that is very discreet. Like you can't really see it at all. We don't have that one. I wish I did. Otherwise I would show you guys, but I'm just gonna do a quick rundown of the groceries that I got this morning. So let me show you guys that real fast. Okay, some chicken breast, pretty self-explanatory. I did get deli meat. I like this brand because it's not super high 
high in sodium and it doesn't have a bunch of like added BS. Some fruit, some blackberries, some raspberries. You guys, the hype on these, I don't know if y'all have seen people hyping these up. It is real. I tried these a few weeks ago and this flavor is oh so good. It does have apple cider vinegar in it and then it has like five carbs. It does have cane sugar, which I'm fine with as long as it's like obviously in moderation but these are so good if you have a sweet tooth some oatmeal i like the quick instant oats some potatoes some squash and then some salsa super quick little haul i also did grab a few gallons that is going to wrap up this little vloggy you guys how cute are the flowers over there i don't know fresh flowers just make me happy it's fresh and like alive and makes you feel good but i'm going to wrap up this video here i hope you guys enjoyed it as always i had so much fun my lower body day is currently posted on the gram so if you want to go check that out go ahead and go there to see the entire workout we didn't film Catherine's entire workout but we'll do another one of hers very soon anyway i hope you guys enjoyed this video once again if you liked it please like and comment and if you guys don't want to miss another video then please subscribe but we'll see you in the next one i hope you guys all have a great day morning afternoon whatever time it is for you and thanks for tuning in bye